Hey, welcome back everybody. It's great to be with you. Uh, yeah, it's, it's starting to feel a little bit wintry. I got my coat on today. Uh, although right here in the sun, it's actually feeling pretty good, but it's, it's probably like, for us, it's cold here. It's in, in like kind of high 40s. Uh, I think temperatures now will probably fluctuate between, you know, mid 50s kind of thing, you know, going forward for our winter. Um, but I'm standing over here next to the new uh, residence halls. I just thought I'd get a chance to see them. From everything I'm hearing from the students, they really do love them. Uh, it was a long wait, but I've heard that it was worth the wait uh, and that it's, uh, it's gone well and people are really enjoying them. Um, a lot happening coming up this week. Uh, so to begin with, we got First Friday, which is where we honor the Sacred Heart of Jesus. We have First Saturday, where we honor the Immaculate Heart of Mary. And then Sunday is the first day of Advent. So uh, liturgically, there's a lot going on here at the Abbey, as you can imagine. And then tomorrow, Friday, uh, we actually start our final exams, which I find really hard to believe. <laughs> so December 1st, beginning of final exams, and uh, just was talking to a couple of students as they're walking around here. As, they were kind of racing back to their rooms to, uh, to do their studying. And I, I loved it. The one guy I asked, I said, when's your exam? You know, and I thought it was maybe tomorrow because they start tomorrow. And he said, no, no, it's next week, but, but there's a lot to study for. And I thought, okay, I like that. You know, he's uh, getting way ahead of it. So I thought that was great. We have a couple of Christmas events coming up uh, on Friday, December 1st. We have uh, Crusader Christmas, which is in the Student Commons, 6 to 8 p.m. Uh, I know they do some fun stuff like, you know, mini Christmas tree decoration contest and there's some food and there's some events and all kinds of little things going on. So I encourage everybody that's here, at least on campus, to attend that. Uh, on Saturday, the Abbey Players have their uh, uh, Christmas at the Abbey. Uh, they have two shows. Uh, I hear it's going to be great. Uh, there's a, kind of a variety show. They're singing and dancing and, you know, a whole bunch of activities there. So uh, I encourage you to get your tickets and, and go to... Uh, Christmas at the Abbey. Um, and then athletics, uh, again, kind of winding down here, the you know, fall sports have sort of wound down. And women's soccer has uh, some great honors here at the end of the year. Uh, Logan Perry, Mia Muckenthaler, and Reagan Cullen uh, all received honors from the uh, D2 uh, Conference Commissioners Association. They got all regional honors. On the men's side, we have uh, Davis McBee and uh, we have Walter Gomez. Both got the same honors from the D2 CCA. Uh, for all regional uh, team. So uh, congratulations to them. And in women's basketball, we have Abigail Crane and Peyton Nation, uh, who both received uh, Conference Carolina Player of the Week awards, uh, one for offense, one for defense. So we're covering all, all bases there, or, or covering the whole court there. And I always finish with birthdays. And uh, they're just such a, a wonderful, again, time and way for us to, to thank God for all the good people that are here, part of our community. Uh, we just have three of them uh, this week. Uh, Jacob Andrus, who's an assistant uh, tennis coach, uh, who's just done an amazing job. Uh, just you know, such a wonderful, great team. Uh, just their camaraderie and friendships and, and their performances. And uh, he's contributed to that in such a great way. And Dana Catchpole, uh, who is our visiting assistant professor of motorsports. Uh, Dana is just an outstanding professor, beloved by his students, and uh, does so much to help uh, just to get our students such wonderful opportunities uh, and internships. And then Kylie Eastman, who is assistant women's lacrosse coach. Uh, she's again, another wonderful person. We're just so blessed again to have these individuals here at the Abbey. And so if you see any of them, be sure to wish them a happy birthday. And uh, with that, I'll just say, I hope to see you on campus sometime soon. And until then, take care and God bless.